Alright, so Blender 4.2 has just released and the way to install Divine Cut has changed a little. Um, when you download Divine Cut, you have three items or four. You have the add-on itself, the, the assets and the mannequin. So what you're going to do is unzip the assets, um, extract all and hit OK. So now come over to Blender. This is the mannequin file that comes as an example. So you can try it out for yourself. You can change this to female using the shape keys over here. So this is the female body and this is the male body. Um, to install Divine Cut, just open up your preferences, come over to Edit, Preferences, and under Add-ons, um, under this arrow here, click on Install from Disk, and it's on my desktop, Divine Cut 2.5.3. So install from disk, and it will pop up over here. Now, if you're using Blender 4.2, you're going to need to do these two steps, install these two add-ons. Um, to do that, click on the button over here it will open up this web page click on get add-on drag it drop it into your blender and click on ok that's done so the message will clear from here click on the next one install get add-on drop it click ok and it's done so you can enable sound if you want divine sound or disable it if you want Next, we're going to install the assets library. So come to file paths. Mine is already installed here. I'm just going to remove that. Click on the plus icon and on my desktop as well, um, the divine assets that we unzipped. Just double click that, double click that. Once you get here, click on add asset library and make sure to change the import method to append. And we can now save our preferences and it's good to go. So you have divine cut over here, the add on. And to add the accessories, we have under your asset browser you can click on divine assets and they're all here so accessories buttons materials pockets shoes threads and zips so yeah have fun